I'm going to do an exercise for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. This exercise is called Charleston Force. Why would you want to force a hand? You might ask. If you ever play in a tournament, they have prizes. Usually it's the first hand in a category on the card. Sometimes they'll even pick a specific hand. If you train yourself to force hands, you could come home with a prize. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. Here are all my strips with the categories. They're getting a bit tattered, but I think they'll work just fine for our purpose. We're going to pick three and force hands in these categories. Let's roll these dice to see which seat we're in. I rolled a nine. One, three, five, seven, nine. We are player one, the dealer. We're going to get 14 tiles. Then I will create a mock Charleston with no jokers. Okay, Winds and Dragons 369 and a Quint. We do have a Joker and a Pair, but we have no other multiples. That's when I usually go for a Quint, if I have multiples, strong multiples. So let's not do a Quint here. 369, we have 1, 3, no 6, no 9. Let's play Winds and Dragons. So we're going to make a pass out of here. 5, let's see, 5, 4, 2, and we have a mixed suit pass here. Let's try these. You know what? There is a wind and dragon hand with a two. 2019 with news. Let's pass these three. We got a west. Maybe we can play a quint. Did we pass a three? Let's keep the three. Whoa! Flowers. I say let's play a quint right here, quint. So let's give up that and keep the numbers. We wanna, we wanna multiple out of these. I don't wanna pass two dragons though. Let's, let's give up a six. Whoa, flower. This is why you don't want to pass flowers. We have a two, one, three, one, two, three. Pass, we need to pass. Let's pass that. Flowers, west. We need a multiple in here. It's random. Let's pass these three. No keepers. It's just random at this point. Let's pass these three. No keepers. North, south. I want to I want to give myself options to pair up. Let's pass these three. We got nines. Oh, nines and a white. That year hand might have come in. Okay, let's just keep the dragon. I think there was a two, a two or a three. A three, I think, was in the Charleston. Maybe even the two. I don't want to pass those, though. I don't think the three was there. I don't recall. This is where it's good if you have a memory to keep 
in your mind what was being passed. I don't remember. I think we passed a three, and I think there was a two. Let's give up the dragon. Oh my gosh, that would be a terrible pass. I don't want to do that. Let's pass these. No multiples, but that's okay. That happens sometimes. And what I would do here, forcing a quint, we got our flowers, we could even quint. What we would focus on is pairing up, but I would go for the quint. I'd make it work. Pair up and build, discard those first. Maybe even the year tiles next. Discard in this order. Playing a quint. That would be forcing a quint. Winds and dragons are 369. We have a 3 and a 6. We have a wind and a dragon. I think it's either or. Let's just hold them both and play what comes in. We could play either one. So let's get rid of these. 1, 7. Let's get a high number in here. 1, 4, 7, 5. Seven two four four five seven one seven four. That's two good passes. We got a dragon and a nine through six nine or winds and dragons. We have tiles we can pass right here. One seven four. Six. Tiles for passing. East. Now we have a pair and a five. We need to pick three, six, nine. There are two hands with flowers. They're in one suit. Maybe three, six, nine with flowers. Let's break up the two and pass the east. We got a six. I think three, six, nine is the way to go now. Sixes, dragons. Let's pass these three. Six. Tiles to pass. Nine dragon. We have one tile to pass. I think I would play the three, six, nine hand with dragons. We have a gap, no three, but we can use the joker. Let's hold this for joker bait and pass these three for optional. No keepers. We have three discards plus joker bait, and we know our hand. We do have a gap, but we have a joker. We need a pair of flowers, pung of threes, pung of sixes, pung of nines, pung of dragons, pair pungs. 
and we can use jokers for everything but the flower. Hold this for as long as possible, get rid of these, and then go into here by the end of the middle game. If you want to know more about how to play with joker bait, look for a link in the video description below. I have, oh my goodness, six videos on joker bait, working with jokers. Actually, I think it's three videos on joker bait specifically. And then there's a video on strategy by wall too that's helpful because timing is everything with joker bait. Okay, oh, 369. That's what we're playing here. 369. Now we're going to make a quint, or not a quint, but winds and dragons. Got to make winds and dragons work. Here we have West Dragons 1, 3, 4. What about East and West with Dragons or East and West with 4s? If we get North and South, maybe we could do North and South with 3s. Let's pass these 3. See if we can make Winds and Dragons work. There are number tiles with the Winds and Dragons. East and West with Evens, North and South with Odds. Okay, there's an east, east and west with dragons or fours. Let's give up on the threes. We need fodder for passing. We need to break up those. Let's do one, two, one, two, three. That's kind of risky, but we got work to do here. Oh, there's a south. We'll keep it. Let's pass these three. No keepers. Let's pass one of each suit. White. East and west with dragons. Looks pretty good to me. One of each suit. We got a four. East and west with fours. We have tiles to pass. Let's just keep that south. Dragon. I don't think that's going to be helpful, though, in this case. Unless we switch to news with a year. But we only need one dragon for that hand. I don't think I want to give up a dragon, though. Oh, the south. We don't need the south. Let's keep the dragon and pass these three. No keepers. But I think we could play east and west with dragons or east and west with fours. I would Pass those. Discard those. We're done with passing. So this would be Winds and Dragons. East and West with Dragons, Joker Bait. Or East and West with Fours, Joker Bait. Big Joker Bait. It can look pretty bleak when you're forcing a hand, but as the saying goes, it's the darkest before dawn. Stick with it. Try to see it through. 
have a backup plan if your forced hand doesn't come in. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table between now and the next Charleston Force for American Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. May all your picks be keepers.